Hey there, NJ, Route22.com here with another frigid movie studio, video studio, top five deals of the week. We're not using a DSLR anymore. We're using a $70 cell phone. And this week we're starting off with Ocean State Job Lot. We love this place. We buy a lot of tea there, we dog treats and all sorts of stuff. And, they, and what we look for every single week is crazy deals where we buy something useful and we get like free money to buy other useful things. And that's a good way. I mean, it's like a tricky way of just getting things for less. This week they have copper cookware things. Spend 10 bucks on, on these things. Every $10 you spend, you get a, uh, a $10 uh, crazy card to use for other things. We like that. I mean, this stuff is not heirloom. You'll throw it out in a couple of years. Next up is Aldi. 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 Aldi uh, pretty much has everything cheaper than everywhere else. Almost always. But we, we're going to pick one thing uh, a week that we think might be uh, worthy. And this week it's a mandarin orange. You get three pounds of these little things for $1.99. We don't really stress the um, uh, fruit too much. For kids, infrequently, like no more than one a day, you can give them half an orange or half a little orange instead of juice. It's so much better than juice. There's fiber, there's bulk. I mean, there's minimal fiber. There's some bulk. Helps fill you up. Next up is uh, Kings. Uh, this week we actually have a few items that, because we, we normally never shop there, but we scan their sales flyer to find things that are a win, a win. And I think we have a, a pretty good win here this week. Uh, there's three items. Uh, that is Sentia water. And I'm not bringing them up again. It's this high pH uh, water that we think is uh, is pretty good. But they have uh, 12 50 point whatever ounces of uh, bottles of water for 20 bucks, 19.99. Uh, it comes out to be like a buck 67 or something like that a bottle. And that's a that's a decent price. I think it's the best going these days. Uh, additionally, they have bounty uh, paper towel this week, which is the kingpin of paper towels in terms of quality, but they're always the most costly. And our sweet spot for uh, for paper towels is a dollar, I mean, 1.5 cents per square foot. That's how much the best uh, Aldi value pack has. So, but it's 2.2 cents a square foot for, for bounty at King's this week. You gotta buy two packs for 25 bucks, but I think it is the best uh, value. And I think it's better than ShopRite, which has a similar sale where you gotta buy two for $12.99, but it's less paper, I think it's 12 equals 15. I did the, the math on the Kings, it was 560 square feet. I think you get only 400 and something square feet with the ShopRite, so it's it's better uh, better deal than ShopRite. Speaking of ShopRite, we have a few items uh, that we have uh, featured this week, and it's this Schweppes Seltzer. We love Seltzer now because we we mix it with our uh, Smirnoff Spiked Sparkling Seltzer. Ah, man, it's refreshing, even in this freezing dungeon I'm in. They have uh, two, four 12 packs for eight eighty eight, and that comes out to about 18 and a half cents per can, which I think is a good deal. And it, it, you can't go wrong, especially if you're using it as a mixer. And this is the last time I'm gonna mention uh, the ShopRite Shredded or Chunk Cheese. We like this stuff because I—I mean, I'm telling you, like, unless you're eating it like as a like a, like a wine review and you're tasting notes and stuff, Shoprite cheese is great. I love it. It's always a dollar ninety-nine on sale for a dollar ninety-nine or under. I mean, I think one week a year it's it's up to the regular price, which is two ninety-nine uh, a bar or bag. But they have it on sale this week for a buck seventy-seven. I'm not going to mention it again until they have that once or twice a year sale where it's ninety-nine cents a bar or bag. That is a killer. Uh, price and I stock up. I have like six or seven bars in the fridge now. That you know, you, I'll give you a little kitchen tip in a couple weeks on what to do with those things when you have a lot of. Them. Lastly, I noticed they had a like a, a higher priced milk on sale. Horizon. It's I think it's the least good of the of the organic brands for whatever reason. They had some checkered history. It's like 4.49. I just wanted to point out that. Basil Bandwagon, if you live near one, they're mainly in the central part of uh, Jersey. I think there's one in Clinton and one in Flemington, New Jersey. They have this natural by nature uh, organic milk, which is very highly rated by Cornucopia Institute as one of the better uh, organic milks to buy. Uh, and that's always $3.99 every day, no sales. Speaking of Basil Bandwagon, we might as well mention them. Uh, they have 
weekly sales, which we don't really pay attention to, as well as monthly sales. The monthly sales, once a month, we're gonna mention a couple items from their monthly sales. And they're part of the independent choice uh, grocers. I think uh, there's a couple other in this in this viewing area. Dean's Natural Market is in Chester. I think there's one in Basking Ridge. And there's another one called Green Life over in Morristown. They have a couple things, uh, some great things, because you, if you really study the fire, you can find things exceptionally cheaper than the supermarkets. And a couple uh, things that I want to mention this uh, this clip is uh, they have these traditional medicinals teas, and it's three forty nine. It's cheaper than it is online, and it's about a dollar or so cheaper than it is at most supermarkets. So that's a good thing you could stock up on for the rest of this month. And, and, and they have some good flavors too. Not as good as Yogi, but we like we like traditional medicinals. MCT oil, medium chain triglycerides, is an exceptionally good thing to, uh, to have in your in your routine. And they have the uh, Now Foods uh, MCT oil for $17.49 this week, which is cheaper than Amazon. It's cheaper than all these places. So keep that in mind if you want to stock up. It's the 32 ounce uh, jar of that glass bottle. And lastly, they have Matt's Organic Orange Juice. We don't do orange juice too much. I don't drink it because it's just liquid fat, in my opinion. But when you, if you have children and they need a little bit of flavor besides water and milk, we water it down, you know, th th three or four to one. You know, just, you gotta ease them into the full sugar um, juice. But they have it for $5.49, which is like at least two or three bucks less than uh, than other markets. I've seen it like nine, eight or nine dollars at King's and eight dollars at ShopRite. So $5.49 for Matt's Organic is a really good deal. Okay, so those are our little items for this week. Uh, but I do have my weekly tip of the week, okay? The tip of the week is, is more like a common sense reminder. You should always know this, really. But it, reminders are great. Just like they remind you to plow your driveway or remind you to be careful in the rain. It's still important to remind people because people forget. It's about sales. You know, you have your 50% your, your off sales. Sales are extremely uh, tempting. But my common sense tip of the week here is I only buy things on sale when they're things I normally buy. Like the cheeses, like bacon, for instance. Like I love bacon, but I won't buy it until it's on sale because it's normally $8 a pound. When I can get it for $3.99 a pound, there's no reason to buy it when it's not on sale. So avoid buying things you don't need just because they're on sale. The sales are enticing, they're tempting. Oh, look at this. This stupid thing I don't want or need is on sale and I'm gonna save $40, $10, whatever it is. And you feel like, like you won something. That, that's, that's the whole interesting aspect of sales. You feel like you won something. Don't buy it if you, if you weren't gonna buy it at full price, you know? The only exception I have to this is, let's say you buy like a cheaper branded mozzarella cheese and then one week the premium better brand, truly better brand, is the same price or cheaper than the, the brand you normally buy. Sure, it lets you enjoy a, a more expensive item for the for, for less or the same price that of your normal ordinary Joe item. Be careful when it comes to buying things on sale because when you feel like you won, it's not really true because you win if you don't spend the money buying things you don't need. So that's it. I went really long this week. I'm going to edit some time out of this, but it's too cold in here. I'm like, I'm rambling because I'm freezing. But I hope uh, I, I'm trying to get better with this uh, video editing. And I hope that the, the uh, new camera or the $70 cell phone I bought on eBay, it's two years old. It's, it's actually it takes great audio. It's better than the audio I, I took with this uh DSLR, uh, I don't know what the deal is, but uh, I guess that's why everybody has a cell phone now. Have a nice week ahead. And we're gonna work on the dates and times, and I, I usually did this on a Friday. I think I may have to move this to a Sunday so I can incorporate ShopRite. A lot of times when I announce ShopRite sales on a Friday, they didn't start till Sunday. So with that said, have a nice week ahead and whatever. I think it's winter, right? All right, take care.